The last day was a turning point because we thought we had failed. <clears throat> and we were getting ready to leave Camp David in failure and go back to Washington and announce that we had not been successful. And Prime Minister Begin asked me if, if I would sign a photograph for his eight grandchildren of me and Begin and Sadat. And I agreed to do it. And my secretary, whose name was Susan Clough, uh, got the names of Begin's eight grandchildren from e Israel. She called over there and got their names. So instead of saying, best wishes, Jimmy Carter, I said, with love and best wishes, too. And I put down his grandchild's name, and I signed it. And I took it over to his cabin to tell him goodbye. And, uh, and uh, when he opened the door, he was very angry with me. And he said, good afternoon, Mr. President. He was always very proper. And I said, good afternoon, Mr. Prime Minister. I'm, I'm sorry we hadn't been successful. I brought the photographs you asked for, and I gave, it to, gave the photographs to him. And he uh, turned around and said, thank you, sir. And then he looked down at the photographs, and he read out loud, love and best wishes to, and said, he read his grandchild's name. Hmm. And he uh, put that over in the back, and he read the next one's name. And he read the third one's name. And his chin began to quiver, and tears ran down his cheeks, and mine too. And uh, he said, in effect, why don't we try one more time? <laughs>